today's video regarding HP DexJet plus 4100 series and I'm going to show you how to do the scanning of multiple pages now first step is to switch on the printer so press the power button on once your printer is on download the A4 size sheet at the rear of the page and we need it just because we need to print the printer's password so we have to connect this printer with our device first and then we'll do the scanning so here once you load the paper open the output tray and go on the display panel so we are going to connect this printer with our android device using the wi-fi direct which is a printer's inbuilt wi-fi as you can see this is the wi-fi direct icon which is small icon between the zero and the wireless if you don't see it just press the wireless button once it will activate the wi-fi direct so this icon must be present on the screen so that we can go ahead and once you see it click on the information button once so that we can print a printer information page so on the printer information page look for the wi-fi direct icon which is here and it displays the name of the printer and the password here now go to your android device and open the wi-fi setting so once you open the wi-fi you will see the name of the printer available here direct 4100 click on that now it's asking for the password so write down the password as it was printed on the page so once you enter it click on connect you will see it is connected on the hp smart app on the top of the screen you will see plus button click on that as we are going to add the printer so printer is available here it also displays the ip address of direct so if you want you can write down the ip address in case you need it so once you click on that your printer will be added up here and it displays the estimated level of ink left now i'll show you how to do the multiple scannings here as a single pdf so we are going to use the toe feeder tray of this printer so just open the toe feeder tray so i have three pages here which are i'm going to scan here so place all together on the top sheet and these go like this as you can see you should hear a click sound here go to your android device and look for the printer scan option and click on that here you will see it says color feeder which we are going to use it says automatic so that means we don't need to select the feeder tray and click on the scan button so here we see the scan has arrived so you will see all the three pages are available here directly you get a save option as well if you want to save it save it as a pdf and you can also change the name of the file so once you do it click on the save button and you get to option where do you want to save it so it, this is all the pdfs available in my phone so i click on the save button thanks for watching